Where are we in women football? Success or flop? The Women's World Cup in Australia and New Zealand, which is due to start at the end of this month, is promising to be the biggest event in women's football history. Women's football has seen a significant increase in popularity and participation over the past few decades, and historically, women's football has been under-resourced and under-promoted compared to men's football. But that has been changing in recent years due to advocacy, increased investment and growing interest. And while the events like the Euros, Copa America and the Men's World Cup are household names, sports fans have not always been as interested in women's football as they are now. In this video we will take a look at the rise of women's football in recent years, where it is right now and its future potential. Women's football boasts a rich and intricate history that dates back to the late 19th century. Despite facing a myriad of challenges and hindrances along its journey, women's participation in the sport has consistently grown. Interestingly, one of the earliest documented women's matches took place in Scotland in 1881. As years progressed, a broader spectrum of countries started to embrace women's football, leading to the establishment of national teams and international tournaments, representing a significant landmark for female athletes globally. Since that time, this esteemed tournament has evolved into a platform for highlighting exceptional talent and igniting enthusiasm among fans worldwide. Even while confronting societal constraints and gender prejudices throughout history, from iconic figures like Mia Hamm and Marta Vieira da Silva to current luminaries such as Megan Rapinoe and Alex Morgan, these extraordinary women have defied stereotypes with their astounding skills on the pitch. Today, the strides women's football has taken are evident through amplified media coverage, sponsorship opportunities and swelling fan bases. This newfound acknowledgement not only bestows deserved visibility upon female footballers, but also offers younger generations powerful role models on sports fields. It serves as a testament that when provided with equal opportunities and support, women can attain greatness in any sphere they opt for, both the national and international level. A fresh generation of budding athletes is inspired to chase their ambitions. Girls who may have felt constrained by societal pressures or gender stereotypes now they see these athletes defying obstacles and setting new records, illustrating that gender should never act as a barrier to following one's interests. Thanks to media exposure and greater visibility, young girls are introduced to influential role models who embody social attributes for achievement in and beyond sports. These female athletes serve as a beacon of empowerment for aspiring players worldwide. Girls want to be like Megan Rapinoe now, or like Beth Mead. They see an idol and have someone to admire and see what it takes to become a football star. Moreover, initiatives such as dedicated youth football programs for girls are thriving worldwide. Organizations understand the significance of offering opportunities for young girls to hone their skills in a supportive environment that encourages development and self-assuredness. That's never been a more opportune moment for young girls interested in football. The ascendance of women's football provides a source of inspiration unparalleled before, regardless of societal norms. The horizon for women's football is illuminated with infinite potential and thrilling prospects. As each year goes by, the sport continues to amass increasing momentum and global recognition. More and more girls are entering the field, driven by their love for the sport and inspired by trailblazing role models. A key factor propelling this promising future is the upswing and in investment in women's football at all tiers. Major corporations and organisations are acknowledging the enormous potential and market appeal of female athletes, leading to sponsorships, endorsements and enhanced infrastructure. This investment not only advances the sport, but offers benchmark study on women's football worldwide indicated encouraging signs of revenue growth in 2022 with 7% of pro clubs generating more than $1 million, while teams recorded year-on-year -year commercial revenue growth of 33%. Women's leagues experienced year-on-year -year commercial revenue growth of 24%, the study showed. Another element contributing to the optimistic future of women's football is amplified media coverage. TV networks are airing more matches, spotlighting skilled players, and offering platforms for dialogues around gender parity in sports. Free match streaming and online channels have also helped raise the profile of the women's game. Watching accessible matches brings players and teams into your home regularly and creates a fan bond. Players become household names and even those who don't watch or support football will know the names of a few more players than they think. Seeing your favourite players on TV is one thing, 
being able to watch them live in domestic leagues or international tournaments is quite another. The WSL, for example, is one of the world's top leagues and attracts some of the most talented players in football. This visibility helps bolster awareness of women's football and inspires young girls to tune in from their homes or attend live games at stadiums across the globe. Furthermore, progress in coaching strategies and training techniques continues to bolster player development at an earlier stage. Now girls have access to premier coaching programs explicitly designed for them. Also, international tournaments like the FIFA Women's World Cup have attracted record-setting viewership in recent years. This swelling interest translates into expanding support from fans around the world as they cheer on their national teams on this illustrious stage. The FIFA Women's World Cup is slated for 2023, with Australia and New Zealand jointly hosting the event. This will be the inaugural instance of the tournament, being co-hosted by two nations. The contest will showcase 32 teams globally and is projected to pull in millions of viewers from around the world. For football businesses, the Women's World Cup presents a distinct opportunity to connect with a global audience and interact with fans through fresh, creative methods. Enterprises engaged in the production and dissemination of football content, like broadcasters and streaming platforms, are likely to witness a significant surge in viewership during the tournament. Furthermore, sponsors and advertisers plan to seize the increased visibility provided by the tournament, with numerous companies projected to heavily invest in marketing efforts directed towards women's football enthusiasts. The 2023 FIFA Women's World Cup has the potential to be a transformative event for the football industry, offering a platform for growth and creativity in the subsequent years. As the global interest in women's football escalates, businesses capable of capitalizing on the unique opportunities presented by the Women's World Cup are likely to experience considerable returns on their investment. As society becomes more embracing of gender equality initiatives both on and off the field, we can anticipate even more substantial progress for women's football in terms of participation figures as well as professional prospects. But whether women's football will be equal to men's is a question. This is something that most genuine football fans want to see happen, with the equal pay and distribution of women's football something that will only see the beautiful game itself continue to grow. Women's football has made huge strides forward. There's still a lot of ground to be made up if they are to be on an even playing field with the men's game. The continued improvement of funding in the women's game and the fact that many WSL matches and Women's World Cup games are readily available for people to watch on TV are big steps forward. With the continued increase in the desire to watch women's football, shown through Barcelona's ability to break the attendance record for a club game twice in quick succession, there is hope that the gap between both games will continue to shrink. The future for women's football is certainly promising. The sport has seen substantial progress in recent years and has now emerged as one of the most followed sports globally. The accomplishments of female athletes have motivated millions and exerted a positive influence on society. The prosperity of women's football has also incited increased investment in the sport. This has led to improved equipment and a rise in professional opportunities for female players. As the sport's popularity continues to surge, it is anticipated to dismantle more barriers and uplift female athletes worldwide. The ascendancy of women's football has been a remarkable voyage, transitioning from its modest inception in the late 19th century to its present stature as a major global sport. It has empowered athletes, overcome obstacles and produced positive societal impacts. As the sport's popularity escalates further, it is projected to continue demolishing barriers and empowering female athletes globally. Do you think women's football is on the rise? And will you be keeping a close eye on the upcoming World Cup? Let us know your thoughts and opinions in the comments below, and we will see you in the next one.